welcome to the Yoga Pantry with me, Natasha. Today we're doing something a little bit different because my iMac has stopped working so I can't edit my yoga videos and I don't have a nice sound at the moment because I don't have a mic for my phone. It's all being done on my phone right now so no uh, cameras, no yoga videos, no outside and the sun's just come out just to tease me and taunt me and say you could be a you doing a yoga video right now and I could do one on my phone but um, it has been raining and cold all day it's only just come out now so we are going to do a little bit of energy medicine yoga next week but this week i thought we'd talk about heart coherence it's something that um i came across and i am fascinated with and i've been doing it in all of my yoga classes with all of my students and it is something that we should all do um just for our normal well-being so what is heart coherence Heart coherence is bringing our heart rate and our system basically into, um, oh, it's such a big subject and I don't even know where to start. So, <laughs> so our heart rate has a variable heart rate and it's always got tiny micro changes. It's, it's called um, heart chaos when it's dealing with the chaos around us and it's always changing and how effectively your heart deals with changes and how quickly the, it, it varies, shows how healthy your heart is. Now, it's not perceptible, so it's not if you have an um, a regular heartbeat and you can actually feel that. It's something that you actually have to be hooked up to monitors for to, to gauge and find um, how healthy your variable heart rate is. And also how um, how to get yourself into heart coherence. So taking yourself into heart coherence is actually super easy. Yoga does it, meditation does it, walking in nature. But there is this system called the 365 breath and it is cleverly named to remind you um, to get into heart coherence all the time. So three, three times a day. Six, six breaths a minute, which puts you in the state of heart coherence and it has amazing health benefits. It soothes the nervous system already. You know when your nervous system is calm and relaxed, your body can come into a state of not being in stress. And being in stress is what leads us to all of our illnesses and diseases and misfortunes in our life. So we, we want to find that place where we're living in um, in balance, in sattva. Um, so 365, 365? <laughs> yeah, I forgot what that is. Three times a day. Oh, five stands for five minutes. So you want to breathe for five minutes, six breaths a minute, and do it three times a day. Now actually, if you do this breath practice, you will come into heart coherence in about minute three, but the extra five minutes, the extra two minutes on the end, just make sure that you are, you are right there. And um, our body will stay in heart coherence for about four hours or so, four to six hours, depending on the person. So you come back every four or five hours and sit down another five minutes, three minutes if you don't have time. But who doesn't have time to just sit and breathe for a moment? And you know how much I love my breathing practices, my pranayama and breath work. And this is a super easy one. So we're going to do it together. How do you know that? Oh, and also... It's um, uh, five seconds in, five seconds out. So that five helps you there. So five second in breath, five second out breath, more or less, give or take here or there, will put you in that sweet spot of six breaths per minute. So are we ready? Find a nice comfortable seat. And I'm just going to, um, how should I do it? Usually I guide with hands sometimes. As I just speak it, um, because the frame's quite small, I'll just speak it to you today. And you can close your eyes, bring your focus into your breath, connect to your heartbeat, relax, and let's get into this beautiful, yummy heart coherence. So take a moment, close your eyes. Feel into your body. Find that beautiful length up through your spine. Check in with your breath, relax your face. That space between the eyebrows. Relax the breath, relax the body, relax the jaw. Exhale. Now we're going to begin. So breathing in. 
out. In. Out. In. Out. In. Out. In. Out. In. Out. In. Out. In. Out. In, out, in, out, in, out. In, out, in, out, in, out. In. Out. In. Out. In. Out. In, out, in, out, in, out. In, out, in, out, in, out. In, out, in, out, in, out. In, out, in, out, and 
and that's it. Easy peasy. How do you feel? Nice and relaxed, right? So that was more or less five minutes. I was just um, counting one om, two om, three om, four om, five om, which helps you keep to about five seconds per breath, but you don't have to be super crazy strict about it. Um, it should now make you feel nice and calm and relaxed. So just five minutes a day. Remember three, six, five, three times a day, five minutes a day, three breath, uh, three. <laughs> six breaths a minute and that's five seconds in five seconds out for one full breath so give that a go i'll pop up some more info about heart coherence and um, i'll see you next week and fingers crossed send me lots of yummy loving vibes that my computer gets fixed i've ordered a new laptop as well which they said was going to take a month to get here so send me lots of loving vibes that those arrive sooner that arrives sooner rather than later and we can get back to some awesome full-on yoga vids but I might do some more chats with you and we'll call it Tash Talks. <laughs> Namaste, my lovely friends.